Your dad is running to, uh, for the presidency, United States of America, and people are trying to get to know him. And uh, there is, you know, all kinds of like, what kind of guy is he? And trying to understand who he is, I thought you guys could tell us, who is this Mitt Romney? What's he all about? First of all, you claim that he likes pranks. He does like pranks. Oh, he doesn't like to get pranked. Uh, and uh, we <laughs> No learned, one does like to get we, pranked, We learned Josh. that the hard way. <laughs> We've learned that the hard way. I know uh, we, had, we have one of those basements at our house, one of those scary, you know, old New England basements, as you probably grew up with. And uh, you had to walk in like three or four steps into the basement to turn the light, you know, pull the light switch down. So I heard my dad coming down the stairs. And uh, I turned the light off and hid back there. And so I saw him walk in the room, was trying to just. How long ago eyes. was this, by the way? This was uh, this was a while ago. I was okay, good. Because so we didn't have Secret Service protection no. at the time. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's a really stupid idea. Yeah. <laughs> so I, uh, as he's looking for the light, I grab his his arm in and, the dark. And scream in the dark, and it it terrified him. Did he and shriek? Did he scream? He shrieked a bit. Yeah, a little shriek. A little shriek. You just but admitted he turned, your dad shrieked. <laughs> <laughs> he, he turns the lights on and looks at me and just tackles me to the ground and says, you know, and he's wrestling me to the ground. He goes, was it worth it? And I'm, I'm sitting there. Because now I'm bringing the heat. And that, and that just made it that much funnier. And so I'm like, yeah, still worth it, Dad. And he keeps wrestling me. Still worth it? Yeah, still worth it, Dad. That's a very so, frightening prank to jump out at your yeah. father in the dark. He didn't like it. He didn't like no, it. No, he didn't like it. What, what pranks, does he like to play pranks? And if so, what kind of prank does he like to play? Yeah, he likes to play a lot of pranks. Uh, you know, I remember a story from when he was uh, in high school, or, uh, I guess it was a little after high school, and his friend was getting married, and he found his way into the hotel room ahead of time, and all the, his, the groom's outfit was there, and he took some uh, pink uh, nail polish and wrote on the, on the first shoe, H-E, and the, on the sole, and the next one, L-P. And then no one noticed it, but then when he, it was a Catholic wedding, and when he knelt down, to be blessed by the Father, the words help appeared. <laughs> it's a very good prank. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not sure they're still friends, but. Uh. No, 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 no. No, the wife wouldn't think that was funny. Uh, okay, I'm curious. You, I've, I've heard a rumor that your dad likes to get people to try and smell things. Yeah. And then, uh, what does he do? He get, uh, this is a fairly common prank. We always of his. fall for it. I don't know why we always. Well, well fall tell for us, it. Matt. What does he do? You know, it's, this butter is turned. It's so rotten. You got to smell it. It's like, oh yeah, of course. We have to smell it right away. And you go down and right into the butter <laughs> or the whipped cream. You're, you're you're ending up with stuff all over your face. Well, I, wait a minute. Okay, so he's basically just smashing your faces yeah. into food all the time. Basically. <laughs> and now we do it to our kids. You know, naturally. Well, that's uh, as it should be. Uh, <laughs> this is a proud Romney heritage, which must be passed down. Passing down. I just don't know, is he gonna be doing that kind of stuff as president? You know, if he was the president, yeah. would he be saying like, oh, Mr. Bernanke, I'm worried about these figures, mush. <laughs> that's a good idea. I like that.